Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta, learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 73, all right. So we should also re-render the songs, pause the currently playing song, set the player display, and set the play button accessible text again, all right? So we'll call the render songs function and pass in user data optional chaining songs as an argument. And then also we're gonna cause, pardon me, call the pause song button, set player display, pause song, pardon me, pause song, set player display, and set play button accessible text function. There we go. All right. So we'll start off with the render song function. And for the uh, argument, we'll do user data optional chaining songs. All right. Cap it off with a semicolon. Come down here. Pause. Pause. Pause song function semicolon. Then we'll do um, set player display semicolon. Then we'll do set play button accessible text like that. And that should do it. Let's check the code. <laughs> Render songs. How about the S? Boink. Check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 74. And we'll see you next time.